guys, um, we're going to go through your Friday the 15th workouts. Oh, um, Alec, maybe we should tell the people why, why we are outside. Why are we outside? Well, we are outside because we are disinfecting every piece of equipment that we own. We're cleaning. We're getting ready for you guys because tomorrow is the day. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, day. Alec. All right. Didn't mean to take over. Okay, so we're going to go through... Uh, warm up first for you guys. It's going to be a kettlebell warm up. You're going to start with uh, five and five of a kettlebell halo, good mornings, then a strict press, then single arm swings, goblet squats, and then jumping jacks. Okay, so kettlebell halo, you're going to hold it to where your thumbs are towards the bell of it. You're going to bring it around your head five times one way, then you're going to switch five times the other. Okay, good morning. You're gonna put it on your back, tummy tight, hinge at the hips, keeping a slight knee bend. Come up and squeeze 10 of those. Then you're gonna come up, you're gonna do five strict press on one side and then five on the other. Really press up on that at the top, okay? Getting that warm for your guys' workout. Then single arm swings is exactly how it looks. Hinge at the hips, come up, squeeze my butt, get it up to at least eye level. Five and five on each side. You're gonna hold that thing up here in a goblet. You're gonna do 10 nice and controlled goblet squats. Okay, coming down below parallel, push the knees out, weight and heels, drive up at the top. And then 25 jumping jacks. Hopefully you guys know what those look like by now. Okay. Do you wanna show them? Like that. Yeah, okay. good, good. So, you guys work out every 90 seconds or every minute 30 for 10 sets. You guys are going to be doing two uh, squat snatches. Okay. Um, so those look like you have a barbell at home. You'll start from the ground, come up and catch in that squat. Okay. So you'll be doing two of those. They don't have to be touch and go. You can drop between. Um, so how this looks for this, what we're looking for out of this is you guys can either stay at the same weight or you can increase the weight if you guys have the weight available, okay? Um, if, if, I'm gonna go through scaling on this first part already. If we don't have a barbell at home, all we got is the kettlebell and the, if the kettlebell is not super heavy, what I can do is I can up it to four and four squat snatches with the kettlebell. So I'd start here in the same stance I would for my snatch, okay? I come up and through, and I'm gonna catch in that squat position. Now this is challenging, so if that's tough, just do a power. If I'm able to try to perform maybe two and two on each side or four and four on each side, every, uh, every, every, every 90 seconds, okay? Then you guys will do a short rest period and then you're gonna have a six minute AMRAP of six snatches at 75 and 55, and then six toes to bar. Um, stimulus for this one is fast, all right? So you need to have a snatch weight on there that allows you to do those six unbroken and fairly quick with good form. And then six toes to bar, that should be something that I'd be able to do unbroken, all right? Um, now, if I don't have a, a barbell at home all I have is uh, a kettlebell or a dumbbell you're gonna do the same thing these will be power snatches you'll come up and you can alternate each hand okay keeping it six keeping it six because it's gonna it's gonna be the same time if I had a barbell okay so you're just gonna alternate it'd be three and three on each arm toes the bar Ooh, we did not think this through okay if I don't have yes we did at home. oh we did not i don't want to do this on the country all right you're going to do a v sit up if you don't have a, a toes to bar or you can do a toes to kettlebell toes the to kettlebell is don't lie down go grab the kettlebell you're going to come up you're going to try to touch your toes to that kettlebell okay v sit up Gosh, she's gonna rub the back row. <laughs> Come up. And 
you would do six of those. And show how you bend your knees if you can't do the... Oh, can't do those? Yeah. This is, this is what I do. This is what Carrie does right here. Okay, that's a scaling option for those V sit-ups. Those yes. are tough. Um, and that is all we got for you guys today. Uh, hopefully we'll see you guys here. If not, get after it at home.